Session four, hearing the story and putting it into your heart. Do you know how important it is to experience a Bible passage devotionally before you sit down and analyze it? Let's find out more about putting God's stories into our hearts during this session of the Story Together Workshop. When you experience a Bible story devotionally, the story begins to take on personal meaning. Story crafters discover theological truths and then apply those truths in their lives. The result is a much better crafted Bible story. It's important to expose story crafters to a story just long enough for them to process it and let it touch them personally. In this step, if you spend too much time telling the story, they'll start to memorize your version of the story. Then they'll have a tough time crafting the Bible story in their own language using their own style. Give everyone an opportunity to hear and experience the Bible story through a devotional story session. Let's take a look at what that could look like. As the facilitator, take time to learn the Bible story ahead of time. Look in the facilitator's manual for examples of Bible stories you can use. Ask one of your story crafters to begin with some indigenous, Christ-centered worship and prayer. Ask everyone to share what happened when they told the Bible story to someone the night before. Pray for the people who heard the story. Then, to review the Bible story together, ask one of your story crafters to tell the story they crafted the day before. Be sure not to leave out this review and mutual accountability time. It's a really important part of the story crafting process. Now you're ready to tell the next Bible story. Tell it twice to let it really sink in. Then prompt your story crafters to retell the new story as a group. Ask questions along the way, like, What did he do then? Or, What happened next? After they retell the story as a group, ask one or two story crafters to retell the entire story to the large group. After the large group hears the story multiple times, discuss the story together using seven basic questions. Tell the group that you'll use these same questions for every story. Of course, you can reword the questions to better fit your culture. We definitely want to be culturally appropriate so everybody understands. What did you like? What bothered you? What did you learn about God? What did you learn about people? How will this make you live your life differently? Is there something God wants you to obey? How will you remember this story? Who will you tell this story to? Ask every story crafter to name somebody they want to share the story with. Then conclude this session by praying together for the people who are going to hear the story. When you dive into God's Word and share stories in community like this, you'll enable the story crafters to experience God's Word devotionally. It's an important step in the story crafting process, so remember, make it real. Make it personal. It's all about getting God's Word to go where it's never gone before.